Hi, welcome to this bonus version of Post of the Week, where I'm just going to talk about kind of how String Map works. And uh, there's some obvious things and maybe some not so obvious things. So I'm going to put an example up here and make sure I have enough room to do this. So String Map. And then in the curly brackets, this is where our mappings are. So we have ABC, we're going to map to the number one. And then AB, we're going to map to the number two. And then A, the number three. And then we're going to map the number one to zero. And I don't have enough room to carry on this, so I'm just going to put it right below. But ordinarily, this would be in line. So the string, in fact, I'll just put it down here so we can work with it. So we're going to work with this string, one, A, B, C, A, A, B, um, A, B, C, A, B, A, B, and then A, B, C. All right, so we'll take this one by one. So the first one, we're going to map A, B, C. So we know that we match that there and here and here. All right? So in our new string, oh, that's not a very good one. Let me just uh, scratch that out. We'll come down a little bit. All right. So we have the one, and then ABC maps to one. So that's a new string. We still have AAB, and AB maps to one. I'm sorry, ABC maps to one. And then we have AB, AB, one. Okay? So that was our first mapping. That's our first way through. Then our second mapping, we have AB. Well, that matches here, here, and here. And AB matches to two. So if we carry this down, we have one, one, A, and then AB matches to two. And we have our one, and we have two, two, and one. So that's our second one. In fact, I'll do, this is what ABC results in, AB matches to that. And then our third mapping, A, goes to three. So we'll do A, and then we still have our other matches. A becomes three, and we have our two, one, two, two, one. And then finally, we have our one mapping to zero. And so we can look at one as zero, zero, three, two, one, two, two, I'm sorry, uh, zero, and then zero. And that's right, correct? Wrong. This is not how this last mapping works, okay? The reason is, is that the string is only iterated over once. So if you remember that there were no ones in this except for the very first one. So what this string is actually going to map to is everything else that has been changed except for that first one, which will turn to a zero. So that's one of the little nuances of string map I wanted to make sure I covered um, in support of the other string map post of the week that we just did. So uh, join us out in the community. Have any questions about string map or otherwise, I have some resources I'll link. Uh, on Dev Central to um, you know more of string map and the other string commands that we have. Thanks for joining us.